Hello friends, welcome back. Today we're gonna use tab index to add keyboard focus to an element. The HTML tab, tab index attribute has three distinct functions relating to an element's keyboard focus. When it's on a tag, it's indicate, it indicates that element can be focused on. The value, an integer that's positive, negative, or zero, determines the behavior. Certain elements, such as links and form controls, automatically receive keyboard focus Focus when a user tabs through a page. It's the same order as the element comes in the HTML source markup. This same functionality can be given to other elements such as div, span, and uh, paragraph tags by placing a tab index zero attribute on them. Here's an example. If you set a div with a tab index of zero, you're going to be focused on this uh, content. A negative tab, tab index uh, value, typically negative one, indicates that an element is focusable but is not reachable by the keyboard. This method is generally used to bring focus to the content programmatically. Like when a, t a div use, uh, used for a pop-up window is activated. This is beyond the scope of these challenges. CamperCat created a new survey to collect information about his users. He knows input fields automatically get keyboard focus, but he wants to make sure the keyboard users pause at the instructions while tabbing through the items. Okay. Add an index tab. So if we are come over here, um, we want to add an index attribute to the, P, to the uh, paragraph tag and set its value to zero. And uh, for the bonus, we want to be we want to using tab index also enables the CSS Suedo class focus to work on the P tag. Hmm, interesting. Um, anyways, so the first thing that we want to do is add tab index attribute to the P tag and set its value to zero. So the paragraph tag seems to be right here, and what we want to do is say tab index is equal to zero. And okay, so yeah, if we click on this on this thing and we hit tab, you see the first thing that happens is it pops up uh, yellow actually. And then on focus, you can see the uh, CSS is saying when the P element is focused on. So if you come over here and click tab, then it the background color turns yellow. Um, let's see, what was this thing? Bonus using tab index also allows CSS Swedo class focus to work on the P tag. Oh, so now we're here. Now it's that that's just what they're saying is they're saying that now that we've got this selected. And we can add that um, CSS class. Yeah, if you run the test, I think that should pass. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this one, and I'll see you in the next lesson.